Quality Signs and Designs, 775-537-5575. <laughs> You have to take a step back and realize just how much of a miracle he really is. Two years ago, Eric and Brienne Elves were told conceiving a child was against the odds. When you're told that there's a possibility that you don't have sperm, there's a possibility you're not going to have a child, um, you sort of feel um, the shame. It's here about, um, you know, shooting blanks or people joking about it, and I didn't know it was a real thing. Eric was diagnosed with azospermia, a condition causing male infertility. After meeting with several specialists, Cleveland Clinic urologist Dr. Neil Parekh offered hope. All the studies and literature show that, you know, infertility is a couple's disease. Uh, Fifty percent of the time, there is male factor uh, involved in infertility, so it's not only the female side. After a year of testing and trying medications, the couple opted for a surgical solution called microtessy. They go into the testicles, they pull tissues, and then they will look under a microscope and hope to find sperm. While Eric was in surgery, Brienne underwent an egg retrieval down the hall. I was being wheeled over to go wait for Eric in the waiting room. Dr. Parekh actually stopped me in the hallway to tell me that they had found sperm. So. It was a really, really exciting time. Um, I will never forget that moment. Four months later, an embryo was transferred into Brienne's uterus. And then, the best birthday gift Eric could ever imagine. I was hoping to be able to give him a positive test for a gift, and it worked out. We realized you know, what we were dreaming of was going to happen. Baby Noah is now seven months old. His parents say he's an easy baby, but admit bringing him into the world wasn't. I will be the first to tell you that it's not easy, but I will also be the first to tell you that it's worth it, 100% worth it. The journey seems long and it's going to be a while. You know, don't give up. I would do it all over again um, if it meant to have my son. At Cleveland Clinic, I'm Erica Foreman.